Hey guys, Zolet here, back again with another review, and today we're having a look at the Ben 10 Alien Force Alien Collection Echo Echo. This was the quote-unquote little guy of the series. He, of course, obviously comes with a little minifigure. Pop it in the Ultimatrix. There you go. Fix the camera there. Pull it out. Try not to rip him off. <laughs> But yeah, Echo Echo, he's kind of uh, the little guy in the show. Oh, here, we gotta do my impression. Echo, Echo! Yeah, that was terrible, but <laughs> I doubt you even heard it. <clears throat> but Echo Echo here, I'm gonna closer look at him. He's an interesting figure. Um, he's got swivel in the shoulders, hips knees, I don't know if he has pins in the, yeah, he's just got plastic pins, they're not that big anyway. Uh, this hip is a little loose on mine, but that's just time taking its toll, this guy. The Alien Force figures did chillax in a bin for a while. I do have the glow-in-the-dark version of this, by the way, it's the same thing, just glow-in-the-dark. Um, he's also got head articulation and his little, uh, sort of headphone earbud accessory moves up and down. I don't know why, but it just does. Um, yeah, he's just white. Some green there, and he's got green on his death metal scream mouth. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> he can sing, you know, freaking... He can do the... <laughs> he's like he's like David Draymond from Disturbed as an alien. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, he's got the Omnitrix symbol there, but yeah, uh, really, really kind of fun times with this guy. Oh, he's got little sort of USB ports on his legs, too. And on the back, this looks like a 10, so that's pretty funny and cliche at the same time, but, you know, pretty cool as well. Um, here he is next to Spider Monkey. He is way too big. <laughs> And here he is next to a swamp fire. While being shorter than swamp fire, I think he's a little too big. He should only be probably up to Spider Monkey's chin, really. But, uh, put him off camera. Yeah, Echo Echo is a little off size, but then again, they wanted to make it worth the price point. So, I guess it's alright. He also multiplies, so maybe they could have packed maybe like two or three in the same set or something. I don't know. <laughs> kind of like Ditto from the original series, but yeah, he's also off-center. There we go. But Echo Echo, I'm going to give an 8-2. Again, like Humongousaur, size is a little off. The rest of the figure is absolutely awesome. I like it, so... That's it for Echo Echo, so hope you guys enjoyed this review, and um, stay tuned. Like I said, more Ben 10 on the way. We're going to continue with Spider Monkey, then Goop. So hope you guys enjoyed this review. Till next time, catch you guys later.